recording zoomed and yeah all right then <sighs> the fuck Terrible smell. What's behind this cloth? I don't know. Let's find out. Yeah. This hospital is a maze. Look at the map. Yeah, I look at the map. Angela vibes. Whoa! Ow! What? Whoa! <laughs> you boy or girl? I don't care. Fuck off. This seems to be a lot of rooms. Oh, hey, what? Oh. Oh God, my inventory is almost full. I think I should empty my inventory. Well then. Let's get rid of some items. The burp zone. <laughs> Mm -hmm. You trap wind in the stomach. <laughs> oh well. Um, there we go. Do I have to keep a certain item? Do I need to keep the purse, for instance? Repairing wounds, okay. Eileen's back. Eileen only weapon. Eileen only weapon? Does that mean Eileen only weapon? Well, Eileen is. What? Take the doll and lots of pistol on with the No, I don't listen to that. It's been in a circle. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my, okay. I kill you with those clips as I have. What? Do, 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 
Um, oh no, this way. I think. Oh, that local Indian. What? Wait, I'm at the wrong. There we go. Oh man, getting crazy. Crazy, I tell you. Wait, I have to stump you more than one time? It's a st st- This doesn't look like a sterile room. I mean, there's clearly an unsterile person in it. Ominous. Glass is broken. There's a horrible smell coming from inside the broken glass. You can see someone on the other side of the wire net, but they are not moving. Is it a dead body? There are a lot of dead bodies. Oh, another golf club. Well, whatever. I have to get my golf collection going. <laughs> I remember when the game first came out, that image was on the back of my official PS2 magazine. I was like, yeah, that's too scary. I'm never gonna play that. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, I really like scares that are... Like that, only scares. Oh god. Oh, it is. Sh this is. This is what true jump scares are. Basically. Fuck. F fuck Five Nights at Freddy's with the cheap jump scares. Oh, this is a baby station. Oh, fuck! No, don't hit me! Oh! Ow. Where, where are you? Some kind of skin, it smells so bad, it must be fairly new. My god, is it human skin? That would be disgusting. <sighs> Wait. 
Wait, what? Stay down. Is that a vampire? The hell? I can see legs coming out from the bottom of the cloth. Okay, what? I remember the jump scare in the locker room in the first Silent Hill. Yeah, that was a mean thing. Ammo I will never use. It's some kind of skin. It smells horrible. There's something stuck in it. Around the middle of the skin, there's still some meat attached on the inside. Okay. Can I... No. Alright. Me not, but I like people playing it for the first time and screaming out of fear. <laughs> oh god, the testicles are back! Why is it raining? Wet from Wayne? It doesn't make any sense. Why would it Wayne? Uh oh. Is it? Why is it gluey here? Uh, I don't... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, fuck! Oh, they are under me. Okay. Wait, what? No, but I think Cry of Fear still is the most scary game of all time. I actually wanted to play Cry of Fear, but I didn't want it to play it alone. But I always planned on playing it with someone. My dad was playing it. He knew that moment already and set me to look in the locker. Look, there was nothing, then he went on and this corpse appeared. I started screaming and he started laughing. Well, man is cool. <laughs> yes! A, a Vincent Pixie collaboration again! Let's play Cry of Fear! That would be absolutely amazing. <laughs> Sterile room. Which one is this? Which one is the sterile room? Oh. Never played Cry of Fear. Why are there so many health drinks? Is my inventory full? The fuck? <clears throat> I have a bad feeling about this. 
it has a key, it's a key. Huh. Maybe a bit long. Oh, there we go. Yeah, co-op is the strongest part. That's why I wanted to play it only co-op. That's why I want to play it with more than one. On the other hand, you would know when something happens and you would let me run right into it and then you laugh your ass off. <laughs> uh, but at least I don't need to find my way for uh, find the way for myself. All right then. Um, yeah, stock everything I find. Um, oh yeah. So we would never let you make wrong decisions or something like that. We are playing and having fun here, but helping too. <laughs> Oh yeah. Okay. Right, let's save again. Sometimes I think the time can't be right that I only played eight minutes. It feels way longer. Oh, it took me a few hours to figure out that you can actually skip that. The fuck? Wait, what the f Okay. Huh. All right then. Yeah, you can press the start button. <laughs> and then you can skip this animation. Even the wake up animation you can skip. There we go. I have the feeling something bad happens as soon as I pick this key. It's probably the key. Okay. Um. Um. Can't use this here. Wait, I can equip the amulet? Be equipped along with the weapon. Anti spirit effects while held, but will eventually break. Oh. Okay. 
Wait, what? Um, can't use this here. Okay, then. Um, I knew something like this would happen. Um, can I hang it back? Um, oh, okay, did it, did, what, like, what's the point? Seriously! Ah, ah fucking! Wait, what? What's that? Is she alive? Supposed to believe that? But it's true. And there was a kid with you. Horrible idea! I knew this shit would happen! Okay, now she can't be healed. Her health is the most important thing that can affect the ending and she gets damaged very easy. Protect her at any fucking case. It's a way- This is a nightmare. It can't be happening. It's a way more hardcore version of Maria. Protect her with your life. It was easy for me because I was projecting Ninka onto her. I think- I want to do something before I actually tackle that. Yeah, there's one thing I want to do before I do that. I, I... I want to check the other rooms before I proceed. I think that's what I should have done in the first place.
Oh man, that stinks like hell. What the hell is it? I don't know. Whoa! I could have just reset the console and we literally reload. The only difference would be... The only fucking difference would have been that it would take you longer to watch this again. I mean, remember Resident Evil 1? Yeah, basically that would happen. Did I almost die in that room, by the way? Right up flowers, okay. The point of that. Holy candle. Anti spirit effect begins working shortly after being lit and placed down. What? Wait, it wouldn't kill me? I'm wondering, how do I get her past the wheelchairs? This is a very important item. I would have figured as much. It seems to be it affects a whole room. I think it basically means it stops every ghost in the room I place the candle. Against curses? Sure. Wait, so I wouldn't have died in this room? Is this really just to scare me? Ow! Okay, um, don't waste candles and go. So, how do I get her past the wheelchairs? That would be the first her to take. I don't know how to get her past the wheelchair. Wow, testicles on a man. Oh, I want it. The man's dead body. Let's write pictures on the floor, I mean. There are a bunch of X-ray pictures stuck upon the board. Are these Eileen's X-rays? Need to be accurate. And I might even use my fucking button. <laughs> Shitty wheelchairs. Oh, what's that? Oh, revolver bullets, of course. Why is this wheelchair here? No. 
Whoa, where do those wheelchairs are coming from? I wonder where I can go with this. You should get a big red USB button with a safety lock on it and assign that to your safe state log. A USB button? What? Everything's broken except for the open close button. Oh, okay. Oh, fuck! Oh, dickish things. Can't even... How am I supposed to get her through all that? Can I fuck those things up? Can I kill it? Oh, I can temporarily stop them. Okay. Okay. They've stayed loading there. I don't know. I want to get her to my hole, right? I want to get her to the hole downstairs. Oh, you mean the elevator thing? I think, at least. <laughs> it's filthy. Okay. Well then, let's, oh god. In my whole white insert lane. <laughs> Wait, I have to walk with her 50%? Th uh, this is half the game? And now I have to walk 50% with her? Are you serious? Whoa! Ow. I am already fucking up majorly. Well then! It's so much more interesting. I think I fucked up already. Yeah, I was thinking that I could hit her by mistake. I was already figuring that to a certain degree. Um, where is it? How can I open this? Oh! No! No! I'm dead! Not dead! No! Stay down! I need to get through my hole.
Wait, what? I can get her with me? Magic pixel. She in here now too. Oh, she's gone, of course. Don't forget to check the door, all right? Don't forget to check everything. Where is Eileen? I mean, I pulled her through my hole. Well then, I have to regenerate. What the fuck happened? Why is my health not going up? My health is not regenerating! From now on, my womb is... Second thing that affect your end. Why is my health not regenerating? That's not because that. That's not because I picked the doll up, he right? Oh man, should I reload then? I fucking wasted so much health because I thought I could regenerate. Why can I not heal anymore? And this room feels heavy. Now you need candles and you'll find out how very soon. Why do I need candles? What? There's a letter and a small key inside. You've seen that world as well. That horrible nightmare. But if you get sucked into it, it's not just a nightmare. Don't get lost in there. If you get pulled in, you will be killed. There's still hope. Maybe this small key will guide you. If you've seen the door with the placard set in it, look on the other side of the door. Then keep going down to the deepest part of him and look for the ultimate truth. Wait, what? Well then. Oh, this looks a little bit weird now.
Well then. Oh. No, 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 we know that. Boop. Fucking bunny. Now you will need candles. I hate this already. Could have want me. God damn it. Why can't I? Looks like a scrap of stuff from a diary. Walter Sullivan did kill himself. He died in his prison cell of blood loss after he stabbed himself in the neck with his spoon. His body was buried in a cemetery just outside his hometown of Silent Hill in an unmarked grave. After that, his name became famous all over the world, and it looked like his string of man's murders was finished at 10 out of 21. But three years later, they found a corpse that had 12 out of 21 carved into it. The corpse was from six months earlier. In other words, the person was killed two and a half years after Sullivan committed suicide. The M.O. was exactly the same as Sullivan's, except for one thing. All ten of Sullivan's victims were found with their hearts cut out and their chest wounds sewn together expertly with thread. On the other hand, the twelve out of twenty-one victims still had their heart. Naturally, the police think it's a copycat and are proceeding on that basis. But they haven't made any progress and recently discovered victim number 13. This corpse also had their heart intact. The police still haven't even identified the suspect. Got a working hy hypothesis. Very few people knew the details of the original crimes and would be able to copy Sullivan's M.O. so precisely. First I head to Silent Hill, to the graveyard near the beautiful little lake. Maybe I'll find the answer there. June 11. How long has it been since I left this room? I can't tell if it's been days or hours. But during that time, they found the body of 1421. I've been having hallucinations lately. I think I'm losing my mind. No date written. The weather that day was very strange. Even though I avoided the earlier storm, there was still a thick fog clinging to everything. Fortunately, that allowed me to avoid being seen and get right to work. The police are still stubbornly acting as if it's just a copycat case, so I figured things probably hadn't been touched here. But I was wrong. I should have come sooner. The cemetery was in such bad condition that it was almost sad. The storm must have raised the sea level. Anyway, that's how it was when I found Walter Sullivan's grave. The diary is pretty damaged around this point and I can't read any more. I'm still in shock. There was no body in the grave. And on top of that, written on the coffin were the numbers 1121. Wait, what? Did he dig up the grave of the murderer and then this was carved into the coffin? Put the wet diary in your scrapbook. Well then. Um... Hello? The radio doesn't work. The ceiling fan has fallen down. This room, it's so oppressive. There's a remote control, the car magazine and stuff like that, but nothing useful.
photos of me when I was a kid and when I graduated. A bunch of tools here, but nothing particularly interesting. Examine everything. Define everything. Burner won't go on. I mean, there's not much left to examine. I think I could give Eileen that. I think it's time to use my gun. Yeah, I have to heal. I have five of those. Th I have almost no healing items. What is this bull? I tell you, if I can't finish this game because my healing items go out, that would be horrible. Well then, that's all I will heal for now, I think. Hmm. Water filled room under the cylindrical prison. Oh! Okay. Wait, look in the bath. But I was in the bath. I haven't seen anything. What is new here? All is blocked. Doesn't seem that there's anything new here. I'm getting any worse. Okay. What am I supposed to see here in the bathroom? Hello, it is Christmas time and I'm sitting here with my Satan hole. I have switched it off now, so now I'm going to find out how it can put us in these weird these weird situations, so it's about time. What? Uh. So what what is what's important in the bathroom now? I don't get it. What was important? There's nothing in the bathroom. I haven't seen anything. I I I don't know. I uh Wow, now I definitely have to be more cautious and now I get paranoid again because of fucking healing items that I actually have to use now.
Ah, okay. Uh. Oh, wait, I have to go. Have you been here the whole time? Yeah, and I didn't see any hole either. You just disappeared all of a sudden. I can't stay here by myself. I'll be cursed. You know it. What am I gonna do? I might know a way to save you. Do you know about someone named Joseph? Investigation about a religious cult and a man named Walter Sullivan. I got this letter from him. He told me to go down, down into the deepest part of him, and to look for the ultimate truth. Let's do that. There must be something down there. Time to use my gun for the first time ever. Oh, I bet. But yeah, don't let Eileen get hurt. Constantly keep watch on your apartment surroundings. Don't forget to heal, and at the same time, don't overuse them. You know, no pressure or anything. I love the drum sample here. Also used in Blood Rain. Okay, makes me think about the Louisiana level in that game every time I see this cutscene. Blood rain. Okay. Uh. Oh yeah. Um. Oh. She. Okay. She can't equip her purse. Great. Can you equip the eggs? No. Okay. Uh, I don't really want to do this right now. <laughs> Next, this no is a nightmare. Huh? It can't be happening. No, not it will not take a month for the next stream. The 
action game about a half vampire from the deep south who gets caught up in a conspiracy about Nazis resurrecting the spirits of ancient Babylonian gods. <laughs> Oh yeah, great. me <laughs> great start already fuck me everywhere god damn it wait how am i doing this there are too many at the same time and then they fall down the stairs as well Yeah, but I'm too clumsy. Yeah, but it's the only... It's the only weapon I have. Well then. Ah, <coughs> oh, I can't! <gasps> Am I- No! <gasps> For fuck's sake! Fuck me everywhere! Man! I hate this! I- I hate the section already! <sighs> Go away, Eileen! since you smell the same way as them. <laughs> How do I get past them and you? It's Stop. A nightmare. Stop fucking going at them. I'm trying this again now. Can you please? Okay, one is dead. Come, Eileen, follow me. Follow me, Eileen. Follow, 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 follow. Perfect. All right, we are in this room, and now we have one less. I would cheese out the fuck of this. <laughs> 
Eileen! Get the fuck out of my way! Try to protect you here. Okay. Okay, question. Did I accidentally hit her in this session? Because I, I, I healed her doing uh, for some reason. So did I hit her? I couldn't see it. Did I hit her or did I not hit her? I am not sure. What me neither. What? Okay. All right then. Hmm? Ever downward. Great. Oh no, is this fog? Look at that, that doesn't look good. It looks weird. Wait, I don't have a map anymore. Oh yeah, this is... I don't know what, what this is. Not even going fast. I go at minimum power speed. What is this place? There's re something weird with my fog. Really? The fog is not supposed to look like that. Wait, so my fog doesn't look correct? Wait, 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 wait. Is this 
this zone. No, this still looks... Still looks the same. Did you use OpenGL hardware mode, maybe? Hmm, let's see. Oh my. The game speed hates this already, right? Yeah, this looks a little bit different now. Okay, the alpha hack was something. Yeah. Okay. System config video plugin settings. Okay, 3D configure hack. Oh, here I have. Wait, alpha hack? Alpha stencil. Hmm. I have two alpha settings in here. Well, can't you just look in your settings right now? <laughs> well, that looks wrong. Ah! I activated alpha for some, and this seems to do it. This is right now, correct? This correct now? This looks like the. the um, good! You just said alpha and I delivered alpha. Another candle. Uh. Oh no. I have to go through every area again? Like fucking bitch creature. Go back, go back, go back, go back. <sighs> you need your first sword to stop somebody. If you will have. Hints that scared me so much, god damn it! That's. Y are you sure you want to play Cry of Fear with me? I mean, I will probably scream there way more. I wonder if Joseph is still alive. Okay. There we go. I wonder if 
that Joseph is still alive. Wait, Vincent, tell me, who do you think you have to stop in this world? You probably have to replace my yeah. headphones. <laughs> Wait a minute, I just have to kill this fucking... <laughs> oh, for, for fuck's sake! Why does this look so weird? Okay, you know what? I try something else. There we go. <sighs> Who do you think you have to stop in this well? You need your first sword to. St oh! Who do I think I have to stop in this world? This is like watching Edge of Tomorrow or Groundhog Day. <laughs> Names start with S and. Wait, the one, the one who wanted to blow me? Wait, she's in this world? So, I do need my sword here, okay. Oh god! You almost hit me, you little piece of shit. Fleshy asshole. So, what I should do is find my hole. <gasps> oh no! Fuck me! Well, that was a bad idea! <laughs> oh well, whatever. Oop, try this again. I have the feeling that can get really annoying. <laughs> oh god. Okay, I killed him, I saved. Mary never used time we said to get it for the low jobs. Ah, oh, really? <sighs> I 
guess reading the exactly, but I guess reading books for approximately 100 years was more appealing for some reason. What? Where do I get more swords? I will find them, all right then. Um. um, I found the first one on a dead guy lying on a ghost lying on the ground. There was a ghost lying on the ground, it had a key in his hand. What candle, huh? Candle. Hey, what? Well, then don't. Well, what? Well, why did were you away then when I did this? No, that was hours ago when I removed the sword. I did take the sword. I have the sword. I took it out of the ghost. Nobody objected when I when I when I move removed the sword. I haven't specifically asked, but nobody No what? You are telling me now that... Well, I mean, Pixie, you were later. You were after that point. But... What is the... How would I... Oh. You use the sword to stick a ghost to the ground so it never... I know! I... What? What the fuck am I supposed to do here? It's a filthy envelope. There's a letter and a toy key inside. Mommy, I'll give you this, so please wake up soon. It's inside my toy train. Put the kid's letter into your scrapbook. Got the toy key. There's a scrap of red paper stuck in here. Found two mysterious and powerful artifacts that seem to be very effective for evading the ghost victims, the Holy Candle and the Saint Medallion. Not only are they effective against the ghost victims in the other world, they also seem to prevent them from invading my room. Just light the candle near where they are coming in and its holy power is activated. The Saint Medallion seems to repel unholy energy when it's warm, starting to gain some hope. Yeah, but, I mean, wait, where would I have found the first sword to put it into the first ghost I will encounter if I wouldn't have taken the first sword? Wait, and I have to use the candle here?
That ghost that you had released, getting that sword in order, follow you and Eileen. Great! Does it mean I screwed everything up? Wait, where is my sword? Huh? Wait! Oh, it's under others. So, I basically fucked up my ending by removing the first sword. And where would I have found the other sword for the one I have to use now? I don't get it. Oh. Well then. I can't put it here, okay. Where can I put it then? Bad feeling is getting weaker, it must be this candle. Wait, what? No, you have, but it shouldn't be in the building world. You haven't got it. There's much deadly and dangerous ghost than this guy from building world. I'm confused now. Wait, what? I can look through that window as well? Jesus, I didn't know. I could have watched them doing dirty stuff. God damn it. I missed one sword in the bloody apartments world. So that means I'm screwed! If I miss the sword, I'm screwed! I missed one sword in the bloody apartments world. What? I don't know what to do now. Wait, do I need the sword now? Do I not need the sword? <laughs> For what? <sighs> ah, no. There you go. <laughs> oh god, I'm so pissed now. Uh, when am I when am I supposed to use the sword that I removed just now? When should I use that? I mean, at least tell me where to get more and how to proceed with the swords. Welcome back, Wiggles. Wiggles Pastor. So I need the sword right now.
I just put it away! <laughs> oh, okay, so I need that sword. But what do I do about the other ghosts? I mean, I have only one sword. Should I really use it on the very first ghost? Wait, do you mean all the ghosts in the in the different worlds can follow me later on? All at once? And the more worlds I go through, the more ghosts they become? You'll find one sword in each world you'll visit. Okay. Well then. You mean I find one sword right now, or do you mean I could have found one sword in each world, and I already missed them all? Oh, I'm so confused. Okay, 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 okay. Well, uh, now it's redundant, but... Ah, fuck it. I have the sword I pulled out of that one ghost. God damn it, that means I fucked me so bad. Oh... Uh-oh. 